Good morning, everybody. My name is Daniel Pello, coming to you here from First Presbyterian Church in Covington, Virginia. Starting out this Friday in the third week of Lent with a reading by Henry Nowen, Acknowledge God's Love. The most important thing you can say about God's love is that God loves us not because of anything we've done to earn that love, but because God in total freedom has decided to love us. At first sight, this doesn't seem to be very inspiring, but if you reflect on it more deeply, this thought can affect and influence your life greatly. We're inclined to see our whole existence in terms of quid pro quo. We assume that people will be nice to us if we are nice to them, that they will help us if we help them, that they will love us if we love them. And so the conviction is deeply rooted in us that being loved is something you have to earn. We can scarcely conceive of getting something for nothing. And that's our reading by Henry now. And for our scripture reading today, Luke chapter 6, verse 27 through 31. Love even your enemies. Jesus looked up at his disciples and said, But I say to you that listen, love your enemies. Do good to those who have you, who hate you. Bless those who curse you. Pray for those who abuse you. If anyone strikes you on the cheek, offer the other also. And from anyone who takes away your coat, do not withhold even your shirt. Give to everyone who begs from you, and if anyone takes away your goods, do not ask for them again. Do to others as you would have them do to you. And now for our time together in prayer this morning, if you will, let us now pray together. God Most High, please take us back again into your love that we can never earn. We confess that we have failed and that your forgiveness is wholly undeserved. We are mired in the human belief that love is something we earn, that others will only love us if we act as if we love them. What can we do with a love that is not rationed, that is boundless, that cannot be withdrawn? We are truly awed. Grant us the grace to accept this gift. Amen. Our Lent in action this morning. Today, pray for any who have abused you. Pray for your enemies and return good for evil. Hope you all have a wonderful Friday today and hope to see you all here tomorrow morning as well.